Oh no! Oh my god! Oh my god! Hi, hello everyone! Welcome back to my channel and welcome back to Killer Frequency. Today we're continuing where we left off from the previous video. Exactly where we left off. I'm continuing playing because I just can't stop playing this game. It's so freaking nice. And this locked is not open. Yes, of course it's locked tight. Okay, the only thing that was there about food. Wait. Find clues to where the frat party might have ordered from. There was somewhere not there. There was a paper somewhere that said that. Chalupa yeah. Cabra. Hmm. People won't let won't get it's egg in excellent. So they get all this. A promotion, huh? Maybe if I find the pizza box. I'm, I'm gonna put all this there. I don't know. It's... It's clues. What's pissing me off is I can't run. So it's clues. I want the clues like here. Okay. Oh my god, that looks so fucking nice. Box. Probably the box is gonna be. Go goes high, I guess. Probably the box is gonna be downstairs. I can't open them, yeah. Nothing there. Okay, let's go downstairs. Here? Yeah. Is there anything there? No. Oh my god, so many. Wow! This game is so beautiful. Oh, here it is. Rooting through trash. This is a new low. Ooh. Interesting offer. For every point that Gallows High wins by in Tuesday big game with every- Yeah. Probab- What? Did you hear that? Did you fucking hear that? What if the killer is in here? No, but he's- He's uh, seven days. Wow. Yeah, so probably they won, yeah? Yeah, they won. And that's why they took from there, because it's less expensive out of order. Check back with me tomorrow. They give them free or something. Ah.
No. Oh my god, this sound scared me. Oh. Bah. I need a key to get in there. Exit. Why do I think at some point? Did you hear that? Did you fucking get Oh my god. Need the key. Not getting in there tonight. Okay, I know where. Oh my god. This is so fucking creepy. You know what? I just thought about something. What if the radios are distraction for the killer? What if he's gonna come at some point here and we need to open them or something? I don't know. Fucking hell, but this looks amazing. Look at that. Look how the, the light comes in. Oh my god, I love this game. I love, I love the visuals and everything. Okay, I know where they got it from. Close. anything useful? Yeah, upon this pizza. I'll wing it. No. We we found it. Let me save just to make sure. Okay. It, it's that. It's upon this pizza, right? Upon this pizza, yeah. Because they have ah free beer. One free beer for every point that Carlos High wins by induces this game. Yeah. Yes, I have. Of course, it's beer. That's great. Are you ready to get back on the line? No. Let's make the call. Okay, Forrest, shut the music off. Okay, Forrest, what'll it be? Ponte's call Pizza. Call Ponte's Pizza. You got it. Auntie's pizza is on the line. Okay. Auntie's pizza. May I take your order? Hey, dude. What's going on? Uh, may I take your order? I need some garlic bread. I need the bread. <laughs> Can do. Where do you want that delivered? Uh, same place as before, you know, the frat house. Got it. And we'll have mm -hmm. that over to you right away. Oh, Thank you. And one more thing. Can you add a note to the order that says to call KFAM? KFAM? Oh, consider it done. The folks at KFAM are huge fans of Potty's Pizza, you know. No, but not. You should really call them and let them know. And now we wait. We should put a song on. Agreed. This one goes out to our delivery workers. You're gonna love this next track. Oi. Which of the takeout places would you order from? To save Virginia? No, wh where would you actually eat? <laughs> oh, I mean, they're all pretty equal. Equal awful? <laughs> sure, but <laughs> if you had to pick one. All right, all right. Not Ponty. He's not Ponty. Right, so between grilling spree and chalupa cobbers. Maybe grilling? Mean, it depends. Do I want a plate full of meat? Or do I want really, really good nachos? 
It can change depending on the day, you know? Yeah, fair enough. Uh, maybe I... Hold that thought, Forrest. We've got a call coming in. Okay. Save. Okay. Hello, caller. You're live on the stream with me, Forrest. Why he's opening Dash. like that? People are dying. <laughs> hey, no. hey, this is Fredman Bunker. We got some calling, Brad, and a note to call this number. <laughs> yes. Bunker, this is Forrest Nash from 189.16, The Scream. And is this Goose? <laughs> oh, man. It's totally you, isn't it, Goose? <laughs> this is such a Goose prank. Uh. Oh, shit. Does it depend? Uh. Does it depend on, like, what I'm gonna say if they're gonna. I don't know. No, this is Forrest Nash, host of... Uh, uh, sure thing, Goose. Uh, listen, I need you to... Goose, come get beer. Your brother's awaiting for you. I'm not fucking Goose. I'm not Goose. I, uh, how can I prove this to you? <laughs> Let me get a second opinion on this. Norman the Barbarian! What do you think? <laughs> Oh my god, they're so stupid. <laughs> Great idea. What? Norman the Barbarian says only the radio man can control the tunes. Okay. So, play us the flow. Wait, really? What? The flow? The flow. Norman the Barbarian demands it. Okay, okay. I'll play the damn song. Okay. Oh, shit. Okay, okay, radio man. Got my attention. What is it? Thank God. Listen, you've got to get over to your neighbor's house. All of you, just say no more. Plunker's moving the house. No. Forest, line two. Hello, you're live on 189.16, the stream. Forest, it's the killer. Shit. He's at the door. Right? Oh no. Oh my God. Oh my it's, God. It's you. What? The party has arrived! Oh, thank God! Oh. He's gone and... Oh. oh, is that you, Radio Man? Don't worry, we brought the beer. Good times are here. I could use a drink. Thank you, Forrest. This is fine? You're welcome, Virginia. And thank you to Plunker and his Holy fraternity shit. brothers. Some heroes wear capes. Some wear sheets as togas. And drink too much beer. Hey, Forrest. Did you hear what Virginia said earlier? Yeah, about Clive. What was that all about? Clive, I didn't talk. Do you know what she meant? There's a janitor here at the station named Clive. Whoa. But your guess is as good as mine. Whoa. All right, folks. Seems we may have a lead. If any of you know a suspicious Clive, then please call in. It's a save suspicious lives. Clive. In the meantime, looks like we have another caller. Oh shit, save. Ooh. Hello, caller. You're live on the stream with me, Forrest Nash. It's great to speak with you, Forrest. As a local small business owner, oh, I find this all horrifying. A killer roaming the streets of our fair town? Ooh, terrible. Ooh. I hear you there. It's a scary time for everyone in Gallows Creek. How are you holding up? You somewhere safe tonight? Yes, Forrest, I am. I'm here at work in my small business. It's a safe, family-friendly place. You called to advertise. Good for you. Good for you, friend. I'm glad you're keeping safe and busy. Thank you. Oh, I'm really living the American dream. <laughs> Here in my business. <laughs> he wants to. He wants me to ask about his business. I'm not gonna do that. Should I do that? Because, like, 
dude, like, people are dying, and he wants to promote his business. So, he's clearly not a good person, and clearly not family-friendly. From the moment he doesn't care that people are dying, he just cares about his fucking business, so... You must really, really love your work. Oh, I do. My small business really is Can you close him? World. What's your small business? Oh, my oh, God. Well... I'm not really big on promotion, but uh, yeah. since you ask, it's Porty's Pizza! I was the sorry. best and only pizza place in town! Come on down and get yourself a cracking deal on our two I was one. sure. God damn it, Porty, no! No free ads! I was sure. I could, from I mean, the sound of I his voice. I can't be that mad at him. Calling Ponty's did save Virginia. I can be mad, Peggy, that sort of he thing. He didn't do shit. No. He just ended it. He just did his job. Mad. Look, he's gone now. We already have somebody else on the line. Just okay. take a deep breath and let's keep going. Evening, caller. This is Forrest Nash, host of 189.16, The Scream. And tonight's 911 stand in. Hi. Hello? Am I on air? Yeah. Sure, caller. What's your name? And what have you got for us tonight? Name's Eugene Stein. And. I've got a heart full of love, Forrest. What? I'm hanging out in the middle of the maze maze, listening oh, shit. to your show. Oh, shit. Looking up at the stars and waiting for her. Oh, shit. You got a I will have to do that. Coming out to see you. Yeah. Molly. Is it Molly or is the killer? We planned to get lost in the maze maze tonight. And you are. our first journey together into the love labyrinth. Stupid. That's why I'm calling, actually. I thought she'd be here an hour ago. She won. And since I've listened all night to how cool you play it, I thought you were the perfect guy to ask. What? Should I call her up and ask if she's coming or wait and see? For real, kid? Seriously? If you've been listening all night, do you really need to ask me? Yes, that's why I'm calling. Go home. Eugene? You really need to go home to your parents. Yeah. My parents are dead, <gasps> actually. Wait! <laughs> Wait! That's weird. Everyone's parents are fucking dead. What the hell? That's freaking weird. That's freaking weird. I don't like that. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I guess it's not the night. Hang on. I hear some rustling. Yeah, you're gonna hear a whistling as well. Molly! I'm in the middle! No. It'll take a little while to get here, but uh, thanks again, Forrest. No. It's been good talking. Yep. Fuck. Oh, wait a second. Molly can't whistle. Yeah. No, no, this is supposed to be the best night of my life. Not the worst. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill him. Do you know the way out? Eugene? Do you know the way out? It wouldn't be the maze maze if he could just remember the way for Okay! Forrest. She's right! I- Listen, Eugene. Breathe. Hide. And call back in a minute. What? We'll get you out. Call back in I a minute? I'll do it for Molly. But please- Oh shit, Molly. I will have to figure out the way, yeah. Well, listeners. While Peggy and I deliberate, here's a track for all you lovers out there. Really? Really? Stop in the twilight. In the maze. It's funky, it's groovy, it's stab in the twilight by knife and It's easy. really weird how they're helping people get out of how these the situations and then they're like, the maze maze. You know, Barbara, our receptionist, she's a maze maze fanatic. Shame she isn't here. Well, I have I her thingy. I was with her last week, but she changed her mind. Why'd she change her mind? She went with that jerk Brad instead. Does everyone have dates in the maze maze? <laughs> Does everyone in Gallows Creek go on dates in the maze maze? A lot of folks do. There's something nice about getting lost, I guess. And besides, there's oh. not much else to do here. Maybe we should call Barbara then? If she's so big on the maze maze. We could, but I don't actually know her number. 
but she probably has maze maze stuff somewhere. Yeah, in the bin. Go and see what you can find. I found that, that in the bin. Be enough. Uh, which one is Barbara again? Barbara, you know, Barbara. The one that's fed up. Forrest, I've seen you speak to her. Help me out, Peggy. She's the receptionist. Sits at reception. Okay. Never does any work because she's talking to Brad all day. <laughs> Ring any bells? Right, yeah. Sorry, I guess it's just the stress of... No excuses. Just go and find something to help us. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have some people that get out of work as well. I found it, so it's here. Bingo. Here's what I was looking for. Yep. That's bad. That's bad. How am I supposed to do that? Like, seriously. Any luck? Yeah. I found a map for the maze maze in the trash. Why was it in the trash? Maybe she didn't have mind. a fun it time. It doesn't matter right now. That's a question for Barbara later. Eugene called while you were away. He's on line one. I wasn't away. I was here. Time to turn the music off. Uh, yeah, I'm forgetting. Sorry, I'm stressed. Save. Okay, we saved. Let's Welcome start. back to 189.16, The Scream. I hope you lovers like that track. And I hope we can help our lover in the maze maze. Eugene, you're back on air. <sighs> I'm lost, Forrest. I just ran and I, I don't know where I am. I'm at a crossroad facing a tractor statue. Tractor statue. There are hay One. Bales painted gold on my right. There are what? He's at the crossroad facing the gold hay base to his right. How do I know which one is the gold fucking hay bale? Where is the way out? There. Okay. Tractor st Ah! To his right! Okay, so he's like that, facing the statue. And that is the so go left. Go left. Okay, okay. Uh, uh. I went left, then tried a right. I have a pig statue in front of me. Three. And a creepy rocking horse on my left. In front of him, and the creepy horse in front of rocking. Horse to his left. In front of him. And then that to his left. So he needs to go there. But there is no left. So backwards. He needs to go back. Go back. Go backwards. I'm at a crossroads. There's a pitchfork statue up ahead. Which five, way? Five. What was this up ahead? Left? No. No! I fucked up. Because it can't go through there. Okay, ah, ah, wait, left, and then he can go through that, there, 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 like this, oh my god, this is bad. Here it can't go, it can't go there, okay, so that's the only option. Okay, up ahead. Left. Go left. Oh, this wasn't how tonight was meant to go. I just wanted some love. Oh my god. Uh, there's a tiny barn in front of me and a scarecrow behind me. Scarecrow. Six seven. Six seven. Tiny barn ahead of him, Scarecrow behind him, and nothing to his sides. Scarecrow behind him. 
What the fuck? How did you do that? Six. Ah, six is a scarecrow behind him. Ah, no minibar. Oh my god. Nothing to his eyes. Scarecrow behind him, so six behind him. Minibar in front of him. Ahead of him. So he's there. Nothing to his side. So he needs to go right. Because he needs to go left, but because he's looking that way, he needs to go right. Right? Go right. I can't run. Much more. I just passed a cordon silo. Nine. Nine. Didn't yes. See else. Oh! Please. Oh my. Where do I go? He just passed the concert and didn't see anything else on the way. So where is he? He just passed that. So probably he's somewhere like there or something. So should he go right again? Probably right. That because he passed that, so he's looking like that. So he needs to go to the right. Go right. <gasps> yes. Yes. Out. You're out, okay. <laughs> and my bike's still here. <laughs> oh, thank you, Forrest. You're welcome. Oh my god. I love you, Molly! Dude. Yay! That was tense. I think I held my breath the whole time. I think it went pretty well, all told. <laughs> I think you're right. If that by was real way, life, you would be dead by now. Why do you think Molly missed Because I date? took so long. Do you think she's okay? Unfortunately for Eugene, I think she probably never left home. Maybe. Maybe she didn't want to go. And thank you for calling in, Mr. Walton. We'll make sure to add the town librarian to our list of suspicious Clives. Remember, report a Clive to stay alive. <laughs> Next caller is up, Forrest, so take it away. That was so stupid. That was so stupid. Let me save. That was so stupid. Report the Clive. Stay alive. Let's... Collar, you're through to Forrest Nash on 189.16. The Scream. Hey. Wonderful show tonight, Forrest. Thank you. Well, that's kind of you to say. Thank you. What's your name, Collar? Uh, you can call me Don. Could you play my tune, Forrest? Your turn. What? Sure. Long ride home. That old song. Sure. We got it. I think I played it the other day. Thanks. It'll be good to hear it again. It's not here. All right, folks. Coming up is that old classic. Uh, Forrest, I don't think you're gonna find that song. Yeah. What do you mean? I played it a few nights ago. I know, but uh, we don't have it anymore. Yeah. What are you talking about? I threw it away. You what? Threw it Why? In the trash? No, I. Uh, I threw it out the window earlier today. What? Why? Uh, and why did you throw it out the window earlier today? Brad was annoying me all afternoon. He played it on repeat because he knows I don't like it. Dude, what the fuck? Uh, okay, my. My door just opened on its own. My other door is still locked. Like the outside door. So yeah, I thought someone came in. No one came in. I don't know why this fucking door opened. Because it was closed. But whatever, okay? We're gonna keep playing. Let's just pretend it never happened. So, I grabbed it and threw it right out of one of the <laughs> office windows. 
Not my finest hour, but I can only take so much. Uh, sort of about Brad. I mean, yeah. I'm sorry Brad was being a dick. I... thanks, Forrest. N no problem, because I know, like... Let's just play a different song. We've got more important things to think about anyway. No. Gotcha. Okay, folks. Here comes some unrequested music. Sorry about that, Dawn. Maybe try again tomorrow night. Sorry. I don't think that's a good idea. What if she's with the killer? Let Ooh. Storm Riders take you on a rock and roll ride with the Glam Jam. I think she's gonna be mad. What if she's with the killer and she wanted her song? What? Of all the songs to request, why did it have to be that one? Maybe Gee, there's a reason. What did the barn finds ever do to you? Mm. Wrote that song for one. It gets real old when you're forced to listen to it on repeat for years. <sighs> why couldn't they just request Roddy? Oh, Forrest, scrap the song. We have another caller. Probably John and she's angry. Sorry to cut the music short, folks. Callers take priority tonight. Welcome to 189.16, The Scream. This is Forrest Nat. Oh no. Forrest! Oh, thank God! It's me again! Wait. Murphy! Talk to me, Murphy. What's wrong? Oh, the killer got me, man. I. Oh no! Why did I ever trust a guy named what? Master Robin? I warned you not to. Hindsight is 2020, okay? Forrest, we need to do something. Goddamn piece of it. He came to the gallows waste disposal place. Yes! Beat on me, man. Carry me inside and lock me in a dumpster. Fuck. I got a flashlight, but. Oh. Oh, goddamn. <gasps> I smell smoke! Oh no, he's burning him he's alive? Oh Hold no! On, Murphy, we'll call for help right now. You gotta hurry, man. I need someone here now or I'm gonna die. No. Peggy, get the fire department on the line. On it. Alright. Now just Ow. come on, pick up. Ow. Hi. Yes, I'd like to report a fire over at the Gallows Waste Disposal Plant. It's an emergency. What do you mean it's not operational? What? Why is there no backup vehicle? Are you fucking kidding me now? He... Oh, God damn it! Forrest, that evil son of a bitch slashed the tires <gasps> on the town's only fire engine. Seriously? They can't do anything. But I have a few friends who live nearby. Maybe you one call of them, them can save Murphy. Where do they live? My friend Alex lives on the corner of Haddonfield and Romero Street. And Catherine lives on the west end of Myers Lane. And there's Jericho on the east end of Myers Lane. Ah! But he's... old. Really old. Okay, I'll check the map, see who would be best to do this. Okay. Okay, shit! Where do they live again? Where, 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 where? Where? Tell me again. All right, Forrest, who should I call? Who can help Murphy? Where is Murphy again? Forrest, really? He just told us he's at the Gallows Waste Disposal Plant. Okay, okay, sorry, I forgot. Oh, oh, it's dead. Okay, okay, okay. I suppose I'll, uh Where is that? This disposal. Okay. There. So Alex lives on the corner of Haddonfield Road. Right next to Romero Street. Haddonfield Road. Right next to Romero Street. Right next to Romero Street. Where is Romero Street? Right next, there. Okay, so...
There. There. Catherine lives at the west end of Myers Lane. M Myers Lane. Myers Lane. Myers, La Myers Lane. Uh, west end of Myers Lane. Where is the west? Where is west? I don't know where west is. West. Where are you, west? West end, there. Of Myers Lane. There. So she lives there. No. Or he lives. She lives. Catherine. So, that one. Uh, there. Okay. Old Manzerico lives at the east end of Myers Lane. So he lives there. And which ones are closed? Uh, the connecting road between Rogers Avenue and Haddonfield Road. The connecting road between... Between Rogers Avenue and Haddonfield Road. Road. So, this is closed. This is closed, yeah? Macaulay Street, the connecting road. Or is that one? No, that one probably is fine. Oh my god, I don't know. Gallo Creek Road closure. Macaulay Street. That this one, this one, this one is closed. This one is closed. This one is closed. So if for him it will take a long time to... No. No, I don't know. Well, then everyone is fine. Maybe one of them. Of oh, the corner of Haddonfield, on the next Romero Street. Will be unable to access the connecting road between Rogers Avenue and Haddonfield. East side of McCready Street will be closed. East side. East side. So there. That side. Right? East. Yeah. So the east side. All that is going to be closed. So she can leave. She can go like that. Or he. Alex. So Alex. Alex, right? Alex. Wait. No, that's not Alex. With... Ah, I fucked up. I fucked up. I put it random ones. No. Why I'm so stupid? That that's Catherine, yeah. Catherine lives at the west end of Myers Lane. Alex is that one. So no, the Catherine. I meant Cat <laughs> Catherine. <laughs> west end, west. There. So Catherine. Catherine. Not Alex. Catherine. Alex is that. Catherine is that. Okay, so Catherine. Catherine! Call Catherine. Alright, Forrest, who should I call? Who can help Murphy? Catherine. Uh... Call Catherine. Alright, give me a second. Save. Okay. They're okay. on the way. They'll what? call from the plant. You can direct them from there. Well, you didn't say anything. I didn't hear her saying anything. Call coming in. It's Catherine. She and Murphy are now both hmm. on the line. Hello, Catherine. Are you there? What, uh, what, what's happening at the plant? The whole damn thing is up in smoke. I... God damn it. I'm going in. Oh, my reception is terrible in here. God, my eyes stink. What? Ah, recycling. He's in the bin, yeah? Uh... Go to recycling. Recycling. Got it. Come on, Catherine. The plant's up again. I can go shredding or crushing. Which way? Murphy. Do you know what part of the plant you're in? I'm in a dumpster, man! What do you want from me? Oh my god. 
Ah! I, I think Crusher. Ah. Uh. Catherine, go to the Crusher. Okay. It's super loud. We're almost out of time. There are three dumpsters here. One for Gallows Creek Council. Henderson Disposal. And White Ridge Municipal. How do I know? Uh. Ah. What can you see? Yeah, I got a little flashlight. It's like old cans, bottles, and newspaper. Okay. What does it say on the newspaper? What does it say on the newspaper? Henderson. Henderson! 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 Open the Henderson container. What? Oh shit, they're dead? No! 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 Oh, fuck off. Oh man, you saved my life. The newspaper did. Thank you. Thank you. And, and I swear to you, now, I'm gonna race Fernando to be like you. I'm getting my money back from Master Robin. Hey, you just get home to your son, okay? We'll do, folks. And don't be an idiot anymore. Well, folks, Gallows Creek has two folk heroes tonight, Murphy and Catherine. Oh my God. I'm sure, their deeds won't soon be forgotten. Great job, Forrest. No time to celebrate, though. We got a caller. Of course. You know what to do. All right, folks. Another of our good citizens is on the line. Let's see what they have to say. They're Welcome dying. to 189.16, The Scream, with me, your host, Forrest Nash. Forrest, Teddy Gallows Jr. here. I just want to say that my thoughts and prayers are with my Gallows Creek neighbors during this awful time. Oh, it's mayoral candidate and scion of the town, nah. founders, Mr. Gallows. Are you in danger? We need to be a town oh of my law God. and order. We need cops who have the tools and funding they need to keep us safe. Okay, Teddy. We... I know. You're an outsider to our little town here, Forrest. But you're really stepping up the bat for us all tonight. I just want to say thank you for taking a swing for Gallows Creek. Jackass. Yeah. Teddy, this isn't the time for your political ads. Stop. I just want to make sure our town is safe and prosperous. That's why the Gallows family factory founded oh by my, my God. father, Theodore C. Gallows, God rest his soul, which employs over 200 Teddy, unless you've got an emergency, I'm cutting you off. You know what? I do have a problem. You're an idiot. A problem that's ruining our town. You. You know what it is? Your family's waste plant burned? Uh. Your family waste plant just burned down, so now we have nowhere to dump our garbage? The problem is that woman, our current mayor, Linda Cartwright. Oh, here we go. She just isn't one of us. 
Linda Cartwright is un-American, unstable, and- You're not better than anyone, Teddy. Just because you inherited half the town, it- Your producer sounds a little unstable, too. Don't you dare speak to me that way. Don't we tell him to fuck off. Peggy. I can guarantee this kind of thing will not happen when I take office. The moral decay of- Yes. And that's enough of Teddy Gallows Jr. for one lifetime. I always feel disgusting after hearing him talk. Just play an ad for us. I need a minute. We'll be right back after these messages. <laughs> Great party, man. <laughs> Thanks. Can I grab another beer? Hey, sure thing. Let me grab you one out of the fridge. Why can't I play this? favorite grilling spree order is? I have a feeling you're gonna tell me. Spare ribs. Uh, just get me back on the air. And we're back. We got a caller. You know what to do. Uh, caller on line one. Save. Hello, caller. You're live on the stream with me, Forrest Nash. <sighs> Hello, caller. Who is this? I need the police. I'm Forrest Nash. I, <clears throat> I'm standing no. in for 911 tonight. What, what's wrong? There's a guy hunting me and my friends. I, I think he's killed some of them already. Shit. Oh my god. That's him. He's just outside. I can see him from up here. God damn it. She's just a kid. Where are you? Where are you? Are, are you somewhere safe? Oh my god, oh my god! Yeah, stay with me, kid, focus. I, I can't do this! Tell, tell, tell me what you got! Yes, you can. Focus. Tell me, what's your name? <sighs> oh shit. Sweetie, you can do it. What's your name? <sighs> Carrie. Good, good. Carrie, listen to me. We're gonna get you out of there, alright? Now, where are you? Oh, the old... the old murder house. Upstairs. I'm at the end of a hall. Um, there's, there's a bathroom, a couple bedrooms, a closet. Oh, he's coming. How am I supposed to know? Where should I go? Oh, shit. 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 How am I supposed to know? How am I supposed to know? Okay. Closet, probably he's gonna look. Bathroom. Maybe bedroom? Go to the bedroom. Okay, I'll... Oh. He's here. He's here. He's gonna Where is the murder house? Boris, I don't think we can... Don't move. Don't move! Mm. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Are you fucking kidding me? What? 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 Are you... Are you kidding me? Okay, what the hell is going on here? 
<laughs> oh, who's on the phone, Carrie? The cops? It's just a joke, jeez. What the fuck? Wait, isn't that... Jimmy, that wasn't funny, you sicko! Of course I called the cops, but, but some guy just answered instead. What guy? Forrest Nash. What the hell are you all doing? It's prank night, old man. We're just having fun. That's the kid. The kid who called in earlier pretending to be the oh whistling man. Oh my god. Man. That's it. I'm out of here. You know he's really out there tonight, Jimmy, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> it's just whistling night, man. That little idiot. I hope he dies. Night? It's a stupid tradition. Especially stupid since that one kid died back in... Would you take off that stupid mask if it's hard to breathe? Who's under there anyway? Hmm? Is that you, Seth? Idiot! Seth is right next to you. That's, oh shit. Uh, oh uh, shit. Wait. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, who are you? No. Oh! Everyone, get inside! Ah! Uh, run! Everyone, run! As long as he's out there, and we're in here, we're safe, right? No. You buy time, but not much. Forrest, we have to... Heather, I already called the cops. Forrest picked up. He's the best we're gonna get. Who is with you, Carrie? My friend. We drove out to the old murder house, and... Oh, of course! The van! Who's got the keys? Jimmy had them. Jimmy's out there. Well, I don't really care. He was a fucking idiot. Yeah, so we tell here. I want to say that. That's going to be okay, but. Focus. Stay focused, Carrie. Focus. Yes. Sorry. Sorry. I'm here. We'll figure something out. Between all of you, she there's gotta to be a focused. way to beat this. Just sit tight, okay? Heather, shut up. If we do that, we're gonna get killed. <sighs> if only Jeannie were here. Jeannie? Jeannie McPherson? Our intern Jeannie? Yes. She's my best friend and the smartest one out of all of us. She stayed oh. in tonight. Force, listen. Uh, we'll see what we can come Wait, up with. Wait, was that and, the get uh, I... The, what? Read the card from God, your mom? Any good at and no, no, Chad. Out of all of us, you're not the one to. Oh. What's uh, going everything on? okay? No, we uh, we're figuring out a plan, but everyone's volunteering to do things that are just bad. <laughs> I think we can figure out what to do, but I don't think we can agree on who should do what. I think you'll have to be the tiebreaker, or else these idiots are gonna get us killed. But. I... Shed. Shut up, you. Oh, Forrest, I'll call you back. So. But I don't know Shed. anything about your friends. Yeah. Ugh, these damn kids never learn. Are you okay? Ugh, they do this kind of thing every year, Forrest. People get hurt. All right, <clears throat> folks. We're gonna work out a way to save Carrie and her friends. This next one. Goes out to all the trapped kids out there. <laughs> Seriously? Peggy, you mentioned something about their friend working here? An intern? Yeah, Jeannie. Seems a nice enough girl, but a bit head in the clouds, you know? I think it's the Not one sure that was down Not sure why we took on an intern. We really didn't have the office space for one. Poor thing got tucked away in a dark corner somewhere yeah. downstairs, I heard. All right. I'll go see if I can find her Somewhere desk. downstairs. She has something we can use. You don't even see what she is. Uh, I think I'm gonna. Peggy close said it her here. desk is downstairs. Let me see what I can Jesus. find. It's here, yeah. They really tucked Janie away. And she didn't know that she was there, somewhere. Scream. Yeah. 
friendship ah. quiz. This might work. Okay, so... Well, most likely to pick empty Everest. Heather. Most likely to win the award for worst poker face, Cynthia. Most likely to end up in prison, Seth. Most likely to escape prison, Jennifer. Most likely to become an Olympic athlete, Hot David, Heather. Most likely to pass their driving test without any errors, Jimmy. He's only there, Jimmy. Most likely to win an Oscar, Lisa and Tammy. Most likely to beat everyone at go-karting Scott. Most likely to trip while running in a horror movie, Jimmy. Well, he died anyway. Most likely to end up in a car crash, Scott. Shit. So Heather is good at climbing. Cynthia has the worst poker face. Seth. He's the most violent one. Jennifer is most likely to escape. The door opened again. Most likely to become an Olympic athlete. You know what? I. Let me go up. Uh, I think I'm gonna close it. Uh, let me go put it there. And... Um, I'm done. I'm gonna close it. Wait, what's like... Jimmy's dead. Fuck it. Win an Oscar. Good, good actresses, Lisa and Tammy. To beat everyone at go karting, Scott. Yeah. Went up in a car crash, Scott. So. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna save. And I'm gonna leave it here. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it here because it's already too long and that's gonna take a long time because I will have to figure out where everyone is good at so I know how to tell them to do things. I don't know, apparently. Uh, but yeah, anyway, that's it. Um, I'm gonna go see what's going on with the fucking door. And yeah, that's it, everyone. I hope you're all enjoying this game. I really do. I really like it uh it's it's just i i i'm i'm enjoying it so much i hope you're all enjoying it as well thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you're enjoying the game too and i hope to see you all on the next video